What's going back today for you guys? Ever at gaming gear, another premiere of Silent Day Pokemon Sun and Moon. On last time, we are officially on go checking out with uh, Mr. Loker and Miss Animal that we are officially going to Seafood Village on the next episode. So let's advertise the like the episode and let's get on to it and see what's going on with the uh, UV problem. And uh, officially going on back to uh, where we uh, came outside to our uh, Route 13, we are gonna go flying on. Back to where we came because uh, probably a hope we're gonna like um, go on here back to Pony Island at Seafoot Village. So this is where we're gonna go fly on stopping by because uh, Pony Island won't be unlocated in like you know in Tabu Village or other um, some other places. So right now here we go back to where we came and uh, we uh, officially got in the handy of flying on charge yard. So now here we are back to um, Seafoot Village. We're gonna go on by and explore around this um, village. So. Hopefully, where on earth are we are supposed to be going and seeking on find uh, whatever this guy's giving me to arm um, to go. So, what direction are we going now? Okay, you know what? Let's just go on and find out where we're supposed to go next. Since we're in Seaboat Village now, so hopefully, let's go on charging on to north and uh, pretty much let's just go on and uh, take a look around by. So uh, here we are, back to where we at. So um, we're gonna go uh, take a look around this place and see where on earth like, what, that we are supposed to go next. So um yeah this is um this is where we at so far uh, I'd rather go on and pick up some berries around here because we I almost forgot the um we we were supposed to be picking up berries because we got the cobra so uh, right now let's go on and pick another one so it's the chapel and what on earth is so it's the last one the aqua okay so we got all each um uh, free on um, berries now so uh pretty much let's just go on charge them back to Taurus. And uh, pretty much, let's just see where we're supposed to go next. Because I know uh, hitting berries uh, around here that we can go on and pick up. Except we're uh, saving much more berries, we should. And uh, I need to uh, exit out targets for a little more. And uh, pretty much, let's just go on and charge them back to uh, the Seaport Village. So this, is, this may not be Seaport Village. So uh, I need to uh, figure out where on earth we're supposed to go next. So um, here we are. Back to where we're at. So uh, let's just go on and explore around this place and see where we can... Um, Go on and check with pe people's houses. So um, right now this is the, this is the right place, isn't it? Okay, let's go under here. We must be there. Okay, this is not it. So uh, let's just keep on going, get it out of here. All right. So um, where on earth we supposed to be going next? All right, I think this is it. So uh, let's go on on to here, to this boat. All right. So this is the place. Okay, I never know. So this is here is what happened. So you came, um, young Ever Ed. Okay, and then you. And right, what's going on? So the chief had already left to set up protection around the populated areas. So you sent her off to the wrong location. What choice do I have? She's uh, researching um her limit. He, uh, we have to force her to stand by to regain her strength. So now we can finish our little talk. You got our, our follow right here. Um, and the other one is a naval, bro. I don't think she knows it herself. Daniel and I, we found her here 10 years ago, unconscious of the shore of this very island. We just finished our mission here. Oh, well, then, uh, she had lost most of her memory, but four things she could tell us. That her name was a naval, that she came from the, uh, Hun, uh, region. Okay, that she had protected, uh, some, to um, tower there, and that she was a powerful trainer. Then she was placed under observation by the international police, all because they detected an insane amount of uh, ultra wormhole energy from her. It may be that she was a wonder lost in the wormhole for both some time, regardless of that she would been entered into the international police herself, and then got her promoted right up past you. Um, her senior senior is that it? Got her handed to the international police. That they um, really are terrible. Using the same strategy that and teaming on uh, setting up another follow even though the same thing uh, failed before. Okay, your assumption you are half right in. Alright, however, this mission she uh, choose herself. Okay, what's going on now? So if it has something in her uh, limit, limits or whatever she is conscious of it or not, perhaps she feels some grief over the fact fate of the UB which uh, came to this world just as she did. Alright, but she is still a follower. It is her fate to be uh, targeted by the U UBs. With the follower right before them, the UB will run wild with excitement. No matter how good she might be, everyone has their limit. 
That is why I have hope to distract the UB to divert some of their attention. Okay, that's why I asked you to help with the catch of the UBs. But you're out of luck now. With the naval and back condition, she'll be done for it if she runs into any UBs now. Hmm. Yes, and I imagine that the false late lead I sent her out on a will not buy uh, us m much more time. But before we're out of the time, boy, how about battle with me? Uh, sure, not a problem. So, uh, what a good little boy you are. Okay, well, then let's go. Okay, here we go. We are battling uh, forth with um, Nenyu. Because I probably go into my 3DS um, setting and probably turn this um, brightness to 2. And pretty much you can guys can see this uh, fully video uh, looking normal. So, I probably wanted to keep that in case. So, he sent out uh, Civil Eye. So, uh, right now, let's get on with some type of Lily and seeing what um, much more action we're going to uh, come around with this um, battle. Because it might not be an easy battle, I, I can tell, because it might not be. So, right now, let's go on using Moon Blast because it's super effective. Let's get back for a try. And uh, officially, we'll go blasting uh, Civil Eye out of here. So, pretty much, we have destroyed it. So, now on, let's see how much Pokemon you're going to switch. So, we're getting um, a little bit more points. So, uh, I see that Top of Lily is almost going to be on level 67 uh, right now. So, um, probably about to send out a uh, Crocodile. So, um, right now, uh, let's switch another Pokemon. So, uh, we're using on the Citadel. Or, no, not the Citadel. I mean, let's use Mac A. Because we, uh, the Citadel is on level 55. Because I really want to keep on, uh, his AP going up to uh, level 50. So I have to make sure that he's going strongly and uh, wealthy. So he's about to sound a crocodile. Oh, what is it? Crocodile? Okay, well, that's why I'm pronouncing it right. So uh, right now, uh, Mac A lower hand defense attack fail. So uh, right now, let's go on using um, close combat. Because uh, we don't have the time to use close combat. So I see he's using earthquake. Okay, well, I have earthquake on my own. So um, right now, what on earth? So Mac A's half HP is um, getting on. All right, come on now. He's halfway done. Let's keep on using something else. So uh, right now, let's go on using um, let's go using Scimitar and see what's going on. So right now, it's still going Earthquake, but Mac I hate because it's gonna take out his heart and his uh, entire HP. Done. Okay, well uh, Mac did pretty good, so no worry about it. So uh, right now, let's go use something else. So I'll go with uh, Greninja today because we already got Mac Head Rock by Earthquake because I don't uh, want to go on racing much more of a Mad Potion right now. So uh, right now let's go fighting with um, Ice Beam. Nice Slash. Now let's uh, actually yeah let's go Nice Slash. Come on, can Greninja go first? Thank you. We'll go on with using Nice Slash and probably we're using Ninja, ninja skills on Greninja uh, pretty well. You guys are pretty much we've been uh, raising him much more strongly. So the battle bond is, uh, what on earth is he doing? What? He's mega evoluting. Oh man, that's some mega evolution I saw back there. Man, what on earth? So the city eyes are grew to level 56. That's good. So top of grew to level 67. Okay, that's probably too good. So we're about to set up a on. Let's keep battling. We got, man, um, I can see that the ninja can, uh, mega evolute because, um, probably that's pretty good. Anyway, we got all these free effectors. One nice slash is not very effective. So, we can go on using uh, Aerial H and uh, see what's going on to happen on his damage increasing. So, it's not good. So, uh, pretty much using Thunderbolt. Okay, man. No, no. Uh-uh. That's, that's not good. Alright, Green Ninja. You have enough today. So, right now, let's just put you back. So, I'm going to use Lilleron for today. So, I uh, see that uh, Crotch Up is super effective. So, yeah, Green Ninja, you have enough today. So, uh, right now, let's just go on and use our little ones. So, man, okay, so he's going with uh, the Thunderbolt again. Because it's not bad, because little on it's on level 76, because he can handle that attack. So, right now, he's going with Power Game. What? No! What? That's not cool. No one ever use that move. Where do you get, um, where do you learn how to use Power Game? Okay, come on, he's halfway done. Let's go. Let's use Flamethrower. Or if we want to use Outrage, that's good. I don't mind him using um, Power Game every, anymore. So uh, let's go and use Flamethrower. So let's see how my damage is going to go. So uh, right now, he's been dead. So thank you for that. So anyway, um, we're boosting up a little bit of points now. So Greninja got to level 67. That's uh, way good. And we're spending much more share. So Absol is uh, coming up next. So 
Right now, let's switch up another Pokemon. So let's see what we can use. Judge Mode. Uh, yeah, I'll put Judge Mode on my party, and I uh, will get my point on strongly the battle. So uh, right now, we've even been uh, raising Judge Mode for uh, a little bit much more time because uh, pretty much even doing a uh, much more strong effort. So. Right now, here we are, it's uh, Abzol. So, uh, right now, let's go with Sky Uppercut and see how much it's gonna go. So, Fatal Cut, what? Come on, easy uh, attack, please. Okay, now let's go with Sky Uppercut, cut. it's uh, way super effective. So, we only need to take down one more uh, Pokemon, and then we're gonna get a move on by healing up the rest of our Pokemon. So, uh, right now, he's uh, sending out uh, Hunkro. Okay, well, let's keep on battling. Because I do not want to go on and revive back to Amaka yet. If I do that, um, if Hunkro, um, go first, I mean, I'm gonna get rock and I'm not gonna be too impressive, so. Let's go on and finish up with Z-Power. We're going with Devastating Drake, and right now, let's go on charging the Z-Power. Alright, here we go, performing the, uh, the, uh, symbolizing, uh, move. Uh, the Z-Move on, um, Judge Mode, so pretty much we, uh, he's himself, uh, fully, uh, forward with the, uh, Z-Power now. So, right now, we're going on here, Devastating Drake. At least the power of the purple dragon of the devastating Drake. Now here it comes. So now on Hunt's Crow is on done. Finish. So we are using the uh, final Z power with our Judge Mode as way super good. And now on Judge Mode has reached the level 65 as uh, way good because um, right now I have not even seen that Tapu Lily have involved yet to uh, Tapu Coco. So hmm, look like you got me. Uh, yeah, I did pretty good. So uh, right now we got 10 uh, um uh, money. So now I'm back to talking to um Nanju. So he says here, bad dog boy. I think that'll do fine. Don't let me down. Alright, then um he's leaving. So now on let's go on talking back to Mr. Loker. So I won't. Ooh. When they um young ever well then young ever ed, it is our time to go get down to work is now. Our final UB, codename Glutton. Okay, and then you say he will lead us deep into the heart of the uh, Resolution Cast Cave. Okay, well, right now, so the final UB it, what we're catching today is uh, Glutton. So we have not had the, uh, much more information about what Glutton is. So right now, I got, in case you guys can see, I have a blur function of my uh, video. So sorry about that. So here you are, as usual. Alright, so we got um, contain much more of those uh, 10 beef ball because we kind of contain 30 today. So, uh, right now, um, Ever Ed, this is your final assignment. But first, my young friend, let us get the regular, uh, report out of the way. Ben and Wiki finished, uh, analyzing all of the data we, um, that we gather on the UV we, we caught. If you wish to learn more about the creature, then you should speak with, uh, Ben and Wiki in the, uh, Ifra Paradise Secret Lab. And now it is time to, we get to work. If you need to ask me anything, I am here. Okay, well, pretty much, uh, we're on Earth, but we have to put fun gluten at. So, uh, let's tell them, uh, him about the UB, so, uh, where we're supposed to find Glutton. So, uh, I'll say the process is a fearsome appetite that allows it to, uh, be the bar mountains. The sign report is single speech, man. Then you shall be leading it deep into the heart of the Resolution Cave, so. Alright, so, but Resolution, uh, Resolution Cave, I mean, sorry. So, it's, um, it's really, uh, so far away. You have to go, uh, further and, f um, farther and farther from the, uh, Asian Pony Path. Or in um, even path pony metal. Okay, so he's asking us to go to Asian Pony Path and go past uh, Pony Metal. So um, right now um, that's where the cave is. Okay, well, let's just go on to it. So uh, right now let's not ask him the information right now and let's get on going on back to where we came. So here we go. We're gonna go on uh, calling out Charger. We're gonna go flying on to where we at to um, Pony Island. So, um, that, this is Bad Pony Cannon we're not going after yet because, uh, pretty much we need to go on to something that say the Asian Pony Path. So, here it is back to where we at, to the Asian Pony Path. And then we'll go on back to, um, to the meadow. That is, is um, Pony Meadow, probably something like that because I kind of, you know, know the name about that. So, it gotta be there somewhere that we're looking for. So, here we are, back to where we at. So, um, this is where we flew there because I... Kinda of seeing where we at. So I'm not even hearing Pokemon uh, crouching. So if there is somewhere we, we can find this Pokemon that is somewhere nearby. Okay, you know what? Let's go running and see where it's at. So um, pretty much we'll go find this UB. Alright, so uh, where exactly is it now? 
So is this the right place? Okay, this is the music because I'm not even feeling the new um the uh UB music, something like that. But uh, Pokemon have been um is, um inspiring uh, coming to uh attack me or and crouch me or something like that because and I didn't see what this Pokemon is. Is this the right place? It head lies in the uh, sacred ground or trail. Um, now we're not gonna read that because that this is where uh, Agent Pony um is because I'm not even seeing where the path is leading to. But for now on, uh, let's just go on and uh, see where it's at. Okay, so. Okay, I think I hear noise. I, uh, I probably can hear because there got to be another Pokemon nearby. So we can go on by and uh, see where it's at. Okay, now let's just go faster because I really want to go catching up here. Because this is the place where we go on and catch the uh, legendary Pokemon Lunala because I probably wanted to go on and see where this Pokemon is hiding by. Okay, if it got to be hiding by the grass, let's just go on and find it. No, it's not on these guys. We're on Earth, but we're supposed to go now. Okay, can we go through these grass? Why is it blocking? Okay, I hear music, and I didn't hear um the GB um Pokemon in trouble coming around. So, anyway, what on Earth is this going? Oh, what's supposed to enter here? So, uh, this is strange, uh, distortion in the air, but you don't seem able to, uh, transfer in, in now. Okay, well, you can't go to, this is, might be the ultra wormhole that we, um, explored. Uh, pretty much, let's just go on and see where the grass will take us, since we're, uh, looking around. So, uh, I just want to get, uh, a little exploring around here and see where we're going, because I pretty, pretty much not seeing where we're at. Okay, so this is Bad Pony Cannon that we're not at. So, uh, this is Battle Tree. This is, um, Pony Metal. That was what we're going after. You know, oh, so this is the Resolution Cave that we're supposed to be going. So, that's where the, uh, information of the UV is coming. So, right now, let's just go on and see where this is, um, going on. Because it's far away where it's supposed to go. Because I've never seen what the sign was saying. So, anyway, um, here we are and back to where we at. Okay, so, um, uh, this is, um, the Resolution Cave. Okay, this is Pony Meadow, I believe. So, uh, right now, let's just get out of this grass. Never had a type of Pokemon, because we can call on Taurus, so we can go and move a little faster. So, uh, there's the Bumby that we're, uh, searching. Let's just get out of these grass. And, uh, right now, I just want to get a move on. I want to get a move on for Bumby. I really do, because I got a really important mission. It's an emergency. I don't really have time for a Pokemon emergency right now. Um, I don't have the time for that. So, uh, right now, let's just go, go and call on Taurus so we can get a, a little move faster. So, let's go pick up this sparkling thing, whatever it is. So, this is the purple nectar that we're looking for. So, uh, let's just get our iron pocket. So, anyway, let's just go on and search around here. So, here's another sparkling object. So, we got another purple nectar again. Because we've been on, uh, spotted a more of a purple net there all of these days. So, I really want to go on and see where this, uh, UB is at. So, let's we'll be going to the Resolution Cave, uh, around here. So, let's go on, um, down here. So, here is the Resolution Cave. So, uh, this is where we go on and find, the um, UB. But I'm not hear music, and I never hear that we are in the right place. So there's Doug for y'all that I'm not looking for. So uh, let's go on. Okay, if there are any information of where on earth or we're supposed to be finding the GB Pokemon, is there any um solution? Because I have not seen where this cave is taking me. I never hear music about um UB. I never heard. Okay, come on. Would it please find me a GB? Would it please? This is the resolution K. I don't know wonder why it's not even gonna uh lead us to um find the GB around here. Okay, come on, dude. Pokemon really has to be so slick. I'm about go back already. Please go back, go away. Okay, what let's just get out of here. I really we should go back to Asian Pony um Island next because I pretty much wanted to go on there and find it. So um let's run out of here. And uh, let's run in here safely, of course, because we really gotta get a move. So let's keep on fighting around. 
over here, so I uh, gotta be there somewhere, is it? Alright, so it's not there. I'm just gonna go on. Okay, so let's go on charging back up here to these hills. Man, I really need to go on and buy some more of those math rebels that I'm not even searching by. So, uh, let's... Okay, so Pokemon can be so, um, slick on the ground and trying to go on by and attack me. So, right now, um, let's kind of move. I really gonna have to, uh, time for this to, to uh, be countering Pokemon. If we do, we can just go on to call on target so we can uh, boost up a little bit. So that we are not encountering uh, any set of Pokemon around here. We got target, I mean, like, uh, Mugdale had moved uh, too slow. Like, uh, he moved on his feet too slow, I mean. Anyway, let's just go back to Agent, uh, whatever we're going to, Agent Pony Island. Um, Ancient Pony Path, I mean, so right now let's just go on back to where we at. We'll find you be um right from there. So uh, right now we're calling the uh ride pager on uh, charge yard. So uh pretty much we're just gonna go exit and probably going on back to where we at. So no need to wear the suit because I'm pretty much at Vast Pony Cannon because this is not the right place that we're supposed to go because we're supposed to be going to the uh, Agent Pony Path. I believe this is the Agent Pony Path, but I never hear any side of Pokemon around here. Okay, let's just go around and explore here because I don't even hear any crouch of Pokemon nearby. Alright, so, um, where on earth are we to be finding the UB at? Oh man, you know what? Forget it. Sorry about that. I've never seen the signs. Okay, can we run uh, all over the place and see where we can find a uh, Pokemon that is encountering these grounds? I don't hear any Pokemon crouching the grounds. I do not hear it, so um, it's, not, it's gotta not be here. But this is the Asian Pony Path that we are at because I'm not even seeing where the Pokemon have leave. Okay, so uh, this is the right place, I believe. So uh, right now, um, I never hear music. I never see where the uh, UB is at. Okay, well, there's another go back. There's another go back. I don't, I don't even see where the uh, gluten is. Man, how, where on earth are we supposed to find that gluten? I need to see music and I'm not even seeing where it's at. This is waste my time the episode. I need to find that UB. It's not there. I'm sorry, guys. I have a hard time figuring this out. You know what? Let's go back to Math Potion at, at the, um, at the, uh, at the Pokemon Center. Uh, we, we don't have time to be countering Pokemon right now. We got, uh, a lot more money today. We can go on and, um, Buy some more math approach, um, math rebels if you want to. Because we're still looking for the UB because it gotta be on Agent Pony Path and uh Pony Metal the resol uh resolution uh K because it's not there. Alright, so uh, anyway, let's go buy some map uh po um whatever it say. Um let's go and buy some. And uh we can use um right now where are the math um rebels at? Oh, okay, so we're gonna go buy some math rebels, so we'll buy Let's say we can buy like um how many we can buy? We can buy a little bit of money. We got 34 we can buy. And we're gonna save out 28 more because we really need to save out all our money as person as, as we can get because we can um right now let's just go back to uh where we at to resolution cave. So uh right now here we are back to where we at. So uh let's pick up where we left at at the uh right now at Pony um plan. That's where we at. So we go to Pony Meadow. And then we go explore the cave at uh, Resolution um, po uh, Island, um, Resolution Cave, I mean. And it's, um, he's saying that it's um, so far away, because pretty much that's where he's um, asking me to go. And uh, right now, here we are, back to where we are. So, no, sorry, I don't want to say the game. I want to uh, go to go to bag and um, hold up. You know what? Let's split that to a cutscene. I almost forgot to do this, because we haven't healed our, our rest of our Pokemon, so... See you there. Okay, here you go, you guys. So we are back to Pony Meadow, and we are officially going on, go uh, ahead and find that UB Pokemon that we are not searching for. So anyway, check it out, press on that app. We'll go to bag, and we're gonna go on and switch into our uh, Mass Rapples now, because we have not even used uh, enough Rapple, rap, uh, Mass Rapples today, because officially we got 34. So now uh, let's use Mass Rapples wisely since we are traveling through the grass. By calling on Tarvis, we're gonna uh, move ahead 
And I know we got um a little bit much more a day to go because um this uh chapter might not be a long day for me to uh figure this um stuff out. I want to find this uh last Pokemon Glutton. So let's work hard and uh try our best to find this UB uh somewhere nearby. So uh right now I'm calling on Muddale. Let's just go on charging through these uh Stone Edge rocks. Now it's way too hard that you can't go travel by. So right now then we're going on tra uh calling by Taurus. And then we're not gonna smash through these rocks because I know where it's there. So right now let's go to this cave and see where it's at. Now let's keep using mass rappers. So um just in case. So right now here we are. Alright, so I believe this is the, the, the place. So we're gonna find a UB and um I believe that we are gonna go find a UB um right from the ground. So here we go, you guys. So this is a newest Pokemon that we were looking for, the mysterious one is Glutton. So, uh, right now, he's, um, probably flaring out the rays, the rays now. So, pretty much, let's go on by and, um, take him out as no problem. So, right now, here we go, you guys. So, um, right now, here we go, searching the battlefield and get it all weird up. And right now, he's a level 70, but it may not be an easy battle. So, let's go use an extra sensory to take him down, uh, a lot more. So, it doesn't affect him. What? Whoa! That's not good. Okay, Tapu Lulu, you are owned. Why is a level 70? This may not be an easy ba um, catch. Are you kidding me right now? He's on level 70? This, we got, uh, like... Okay, this might not be an easy Pokemon. This may not be. Okay, so let's go using something now. We can use Dark Little Rat. Let's go use it. So, take it out a little bit AP. Alright, you think you're so tough, huh? Okay, that's not good. That's definitely not good. So, you're using Wing Out. What? What is Wingard going to do with me? Okay, that's not good. Let's just go using, um... Okay, we're going to just try out some Z-Power. Let's go use a Militia Moonsault. Alright, I know you're going to love one of this. Because, uh, right now, Militia Moonsault is one of my best Z-Power I ever used on Incineroar. Because, pretty much, uh, literally, it's surrounded by the Z-Move. Right this now, so we're, so we're looking at this, um, cutscene. Uh, Militia Moonsault. So, let's just go on and, uh, see what this, um... His, um, accuracy damage is going to take to, uh, destroy this, um, uh, like, take it out a little bit of AP as you can get. Come on now. So, pretty much not very fast as well. Now he's going fresh. Okay, so fresh is not good. So, let's go on and finish, um, throwing some, um, mass, um, beef balls. See if we get them. So, right now, let's see how much beef ball we got so far. So, right now, right out the bat, we're going to go using 35. I mean, if we got, um, over here, according to this, we got 35, uh, beast ball. So, right now, let's go throw it directly towards him. And, uh, right now, let's see. Come on, beast balls. Oh, you got to be joking. He's going with fresh again. That's not cool. Oh, come on now. I'm about to go on using Lamnala because right now, I don't like this. Okay, now he's confused. I don't understand why this Pokemon is so good. Okay, now let's just go using uh, Green Ninja, or if we want to, I don't mind. Let's just go on using him. Let's take it out a little bit of AP we can get. I don't know why this Pokemon is not um, easy to catch by Beast Ball, because he's so unbreakable. Okay, come on. Take it out a little bit more. So he's still confused. He's not going to start attacking, is he? So he's going fresh. Come on, stop with the fresh. You, are you kidding me right now? We should just go with water stricken and then we take it down a little bit AP. So the battlefield's gone, so right now let's go using the next Pokemon. So none other than uh, Judge Mo or Mac A, of course. Look, 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 we'll use Mac A. I don't mind. We gotta, I need to take Mac A out. So we gotta go use Lonala next time. Next time we'll go with that. This is not an easy uh, catch a Pokemon. Man, how are we gonna catch this dude? Come on, Beast Ball, stop breaking balls. Come on. Come on, Beast Balls. Come on, please. Done. Come on, we're so close. We're so close. Jeez, come on. Man, you, you, you gotta stop being that stronger. I don't know why this Pokemon had to be that strong. Okay, what, let's just go on and, um, come on. Can we at least take him out? How he's on level 70? That is not easy, Pokemon. Come on, stop the AP. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, you know what? Let's just come back there later. We don't have time for this. 
We'll go by and catch, um, catch them later. We're gonna go back. So let's um go return back to the, um to the PC Center or the Pokemon Center. I mean, and uh, let's go heal up the Pokemon and get some more Max Potion. That's so I'll uh, see you there. Okay, you guys, here we go. So we are back here onto um Resolution uh, Resolution Cave uh, probably, and uh but hopefully because I really have uh probably got all a uh, Pokemon healing now. So we got Lunala on the first column, top on the second column. On uh, for the rest of the uh, column, so pretty much we got all Pokemon Square because we really got a tough battle today with Glutton because he's really not easy to catch. So we're gonna try hard back to catch him. No words, you guys, because he's pretty hard to catch. So right now, I believe so. And uh, right now we got a first to 13 match potion today. And uh, check it out with Bab because I probably go on rushing to the uh, to the uh, P uh, Pokemon Market to go pick pick them up so we can uh, heal the rest of our Pokemon. Because we got enough variety today, so uh, here we go back with um Glutton because he's uh pretty um this is not an easy Pokemon. I don't understand why he's on level seventy. Can he be at least to level sixty five or something? Not on level seventy. I mean this Pokemon is not e easy to catch. All right, so let's go using Z Power. Let's use uh Sub Zero Slammer. We can take it down a little bit much more AP on it. So let's go and um, uh, unleash the power of the Z move on Lunala and uh, officially going on be using Sub Zero Slammer by um, using the uh, Z move and the uh, Z power by Sub. Um, that's why I just saw it say just Sub Zero Slammer. So here you go, we're leasing the uh, Ice Blaster. So how much is it gonna do? Come on, just tell me. Okay, not good. So we're not gonna use Z power. Okay, I know Lunala is a legendary Pokemon, so. Right now, let's just go on and try it again because pretty much you want to use legendary Pokemon like the, uh, the biggest Pokemon you ever use. So right now, he's not hidden, so let's go on and keep finding him. So come on, where does Pokemon be? Let's go around in circles. Okay, here we go. So now on here is um, back with Glutton. So pretty much, we're gonna go, uh, I'm going to try using Phantom Force. So I, I really want to really take him down with uh, a little bit of AP. Yeah, man, this is some creepy weird um, Pokemon, but I'm not even discovered because he looks so weird some of the time because he's not that huge. So anyway, uh, Glutton doesn't look that huge anymore because um, probably he looks uh, a little big because um, right now, uh, let's just go on and use an uh, Ice Beam and see how much it's going to go. So uh, right now, let's release the Ice Beam and see how much it's going to do. So we took it out a little bit AP, not bad. So you're going with Heavy Slam. The fish is going to take me out. So, uh, right now, not bad. So, right now, uh, in case you have Lunala or, uh, Salagio, um, whatever that Pokemon name is that look like a tiger, Salagio, and, uh, pretty much you can, uh, use legendary Pokemon in order to be out uh, catching gluten. So, you're not gonna be out of beat ball, pretty much easy since, uh, you're doing it. So, you don't want to use, um, Top of Lily or Litteron, your Incineroar, or the rest of the, uh, Pokemon that legendary you're not using, okay? Because only when you're using uh, Lunala, it's the um, best type of Pokemon you're using, okay? So keep that case in mind and clear. So right now, here you go, ladies and gentlemen. You have got here is Guzzlord. Oh, Guzzlord? I thought it's the name mission that we are catching Glutton because it's Guzzlord. Okay, I'm sorry about that. I didn't want to name it Glutton. So right now, Dangerous Ultra Beast is appeared to be eaten uh, constantly, but for set, uh, some reason, the drop in have never been found. Okay, well, pretty much, let's check on this creed. And check out with action. Let's go on um, check out with action right now. He doing some. Uh, what are they doing? Chewing. He does his roaring, something like that, and he does. Okay, it's roar. And that's all his third action moves. Okay, so right now we're pressing on A, and right now we're not gonna nickname him. We're gonna uh, send him to the box. And right now here we have it. So we're gonna catch up one more, and then we're gonna report back to Mr. Loker. So. Oh, we, we successfully completed the mission. Okay, good. So, we just caught one Pokemon today. It's, uh, Guzzlore. So, now on, since we're doing that, that's the, um, so we have caught the last UB Pokemon, um, Guzzlore. And right now, we officially, um, took down all the UB, uh, Pokemon and want to befriend them all. So, I just want, I just rush ahead to the, uh, Edgestone because I pretty much not want to do that. So, right now, let's just go on back to where we, uh, came. Uh, reporting back to Mr. Loker by uh, flying on back ahead. We're gonna go on back to here. Is um, right into the center is the um, Seafolk Village. So right now, let's just go on back to where we meet him. And right now, let's just get a move along because uh, we can um, 
I want to go back, back to uh, the PC Center and uh, remove the Nala because we did a pretty good, uh, great job on catching um, Gus Lord. So now I'm going on back here. We're going to go on uh, squishing on to uh, the City Eye. And uh, we're going to put him back to where he belongs because pretty much let's just press on uh, A. And we're moving to the first column and then we'll put back top of Lily in the first column. So right now we are done enough with the Nala today. So uh, pretty much we did good, great effort. So right now, here we go back to where we are outside, and uh, right now let's go on uh, charging back to Taurus, and we're gonna go speed around while well, boosting too much speed uh, since I'm charging out ticket. So uh, getting another Taurus, we're gonna go back to here, and uh, reporting back to where we are last came. So right now, let's finish this mission. Uh, I mean, this mission right now, whatever I'm saying, right? So right now we're saying I finished the mission. Amazing, bravo! You have done it. I must call the chief back at once. All right, go along and tell him. Okay, so here she is now. So I finished sending the data from the GBU protected it to HQ and to Miss Wiggy as well. Thank you, uh, you for your hard work, ever Ed. Now we will be able to learn all there is to know about Gus Lord, or otherwise known as GB Glutton. Okay, so we have we done it, Chief. Yes, we have successfully contained all the GBs. Okay, thank you, uh, you so much for all your hard work uh, on these mission, ever Ed. And Mr. Loker. Uh, not at all. I, all I did was provide backup to the two of you. It was all you and ever Ed Chief. And now that we have finally completed our mission, I will treat us all to the feast of... Uh, one moment, please. What? Uh, what is it, Chief? We have finally reached our grand final, which uh, we should end this bit, uh, big feast. Our truly f final finish requires that we go to April Paradise and report to Miss Wiki that we have contained all of the UBs. Oh, indeed, you are right, and we must thank her for the uh, Pokeballs, known as Ultra Beast, uh, Beast Balls. I mean, sorry. We will be going to April Paradise to report to Miss Wiki about our success. If you are free, why don't you come along as well, Ever Ed? We made for the secret lab in the lower floor of April Paradise. We don't. You, um, why don't you join us, Ever Ed? Uh, sure, I don't mind. So, right now, uh, we will definitely go on back to April Paradise and report to, uh, Wiki, uh, Matt, um, Random Wiki on the next episode, you guys. So, um, pretty much we have captured the, uh, final UB, is, uh, Gus Lord. And, uh, pretty much there are gonna be no more, um, UB stuff behind, uh, spread it all over the, uh, Alola region. So, that'll be it, you guys. So, if you ever touch enjoy my Let's Play Pokemon Sun and Moon, ever touch it right now or like in the episode, share it to a friend, subscribe, and I'll probably be ever touch to add some subscribers. And if you want to win, shout simple by way next time in the future, alright? So, uh, pretty much, uh, yes, that'll be it, okay? So, uh, help, uh, support this by, uh, reaching up to 70 to 80 subscribers as we can by sharing it to your buddy. And pretty much help support it by uh, reaching up much more higher to 80 subscribers. And if you want to win shout you're new to my channel, stay active to my channel at now. And uh, you'll be notified to win a shout if you uh, can. And uh, keep up the great work, you guys. So uh, stay advertising active. And uh, yeah, follow me on Google and Twitter if you have Patreon. Become a Patreon fan, uh, supportive. And uh, pretty much uh, donate me money, of course. And uh, if you want to donate me a little bit or a lot of it, it's up to you, okay? Because uh, all, we donate Patreon money to, on my website to grow my channel in the future. Because that's what I'm supposed to do. Because I'll be um, going to college next year since uh, uh, college uh, this fall. Because probably on the summer. So uh, right now, um, that'll be it. Alright, so uh, you want to click and uh, watch YouTube playlists, you can. And go click on my right and subscribe. And we'll see you guys on the next episode of Pokemon Sun and Moon. Take care, you guys. And cut, touch, cut, talk to you guys next time.